Bitcoin is a technology that allows you to um, perform a number of applications without the need for a third party. So the main one that people are talking about is the currency aspect and the third party that it allows you to remove are central authorities such as governments and banks. So it kind of cuts out uh, a kind of uh, sort of middleman process in a way. It goes from one place to another directly. Yes. How does a digital, how does it work as a digital currency then? Is it only for use on the internet? No, it's used for, on the internet um, is the first place where it started, but it's now being used in the real world and uh, you can use that through your mobile phone, for example, or tablets, any device really that connects to the internet. Um, how do we sort of know um, what it's like in terms of its value and how is it, how is it sort of backed and ranked? It's not um, backed by a government, it's actually open source technology, so it's, it's, it's a little bit like Wikipedia, it's owned by everyone and okay. uh, in terms of understanding what's happening with Bitcoin, you can look for example on the blockchain which is the um, public database of all transactions that happen on Bitcoin. Okay, uh, so your, your event then, the, the festival, uh, what is it um, sort of going to do in terms of promoting Bitcoin then? How is it going to do that? Um, what we want to do with Blockstock is to show bit, um, people that Bitcoin's normal. It's a currency like any other and you can use it for everyday things. So for example, you can um, buy coffee with Bitcoin, you can buy dinner, you can um, buy uh, tickets to a gig, go to a comedy show, even yoga classes. Yeah. Uh, so you can do anything that you do with normal money. So we just want to show people that it is normal, it's very easy to use and there are lots of places where you can use Bitcoin as well. How is it being used at the, across the capital at the moment? Is it easy to just sort of go out and, and get Bitcoin and, and use it in places sort of on the high street? Uh, it's, just, it's getting more easy. So in the last few months, uh, in terms of uh, the average person who maybe didn't know about Bitcoin before, you can now go to an ATM machine and purchase Bitcoins. Oh, There's a number you? of ATMs um, in Shoreditch. So yeah. there are two locations in Shoreditch that have um, ATMs. Or, sorry, three locations yeah. now. Um, so that's a little bit easier for people. Uh, you can also go on the internet and purchase Bitcoins. For example, if you go to our website, blockstock.co.uk, you can yeah. actually um, see some information as where you can buy Bitcoins online.